The news of five people losing their lives after their submersible went missing has shocked the world. Among those who offered their tribute was Hollywood director James Cameron, who made the iconic movie on the maiden and the final voyage of the Titanic, starring Leonardo DiCaprio and Kate Winslet. The Titanic's director and deep sea explorer said that he had suspected the submersible imploded soon after it lost contact with its surface support ship. Cameron, who is part owner of Triton Submarines, which makes submersibles for research and tourism, said that he came to this conclusion based on the information revealed from his sources. While talking to news outlet Reuters, Cameron said and I quote, We got confirmation within an hour that there had been a loud bang at the same time the subcom went lost. A loud bang on the hydrophones, loss of transponder, loss of comms, I knew what happened, the sub imploded. Cameron also drew a parallel between the 1912 Titanic disaster and the Titan implosion, saying that in both the cases, the people leading the expedition ignored warning signs which endangered people's life. He also said that he was skeptical of Ocean Gate building a submersible with a composite carbon fiber and titanium hull. The U.S. Coast Guard on Tuesday said that all five crew members of the deep-sea submersible Titan lost their lives in a catastrophic implosion. The Titan, operated by U.S.-based company Ocean Gate Expedition, had been missing since it lost contact with its surface support ship on Sunday morning about an hour and 45 minutes into what should have been a two-hour dive to the world's most famous shipwreck. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.